welcome to my channel i'm mark this is max mods right guys this is the final video of this epic lego death star build we are going to be finally finishing off all the minifigures and the little accessories to go with it now i just show you what we're going to be working on so if i just get that into shot we've got some um figures here we've got some more here to do and quite a few and then here we've got some of the accessories that we've got to make for this this should be a nice short video but after uh, i've done all this what i'll do is i'll put them all in the death star and then we'll have a finale at the end showing you exactly um it all in place and it arranged how i want it it's a bit like dressing a doll's house really um putting all the figures where i want them um gonna have to decide on what that's gonna be but uh yeah i'm really looking forward to this we have got uh in here i did mark it off um a page that we do have to do that we didn't do which was oh i didn't mean to move the camera there we go uh which is these bits for the trash compactor um so we'll be doing them as well so i'm looking forward to this i can't wait to get this thing finished finally and uh yeah so enjoy and i'll uh, see you at the end
Okay guys, so here it is. We have the finished Death Star. I've got all the uh, minifigures in place that I want now. Uh, I'm happy with that. I'll kind of show you around. So here we have the trash compactor. Um, in that I put uh, Han Solo in there. We can move these walls in and out if we want to. If we move over here, we have Obi-Wan Kenobi there shutting down the shield generators. So I thought that would be a good place to put him. Then if we just go over to here, I've put uh, the Luke and Leia there uh, ready to sort of jump over the bridge over to the side. So I thought that looked a lot better there. And then down there, I've got the uh, black R2-D2 and the little trolley uh, in there just, um, yeah, working, working away. So if I go up to the next level, we've got two Stormtroopers there with uh, Darth Vader's TIE Fighter. Again, that can be moved, so it can be moved around. Fantastic. There we have the main weapon and just as you see there I've got uh, C3PO and R2D2. Now if I twizzle this at the top we can move that up and down and also we can move it to the right or to the left whatever way. So I'm really chuffed with that. Uh, we've got another officer there working away. Uh, there we've got the sort of trash, uh, the uh, prison scene, the cell block. Um, we've got Chewbacca there, we've got Han, we've got Luke. So I thought that was alright. That's actually supposed to stick out, so I don't know why that's not. And then we've got a lot going in this room, but this is the Emperor's Throne Room. I had to do this justice because this, this is the penultimate st scene in uh, Rule, uh, Return of the Jedi. There we have the Emperor, we have Darth Vader, we have Luke, and then we have the Emperor's Guards as well. So that is that level. Now if I go up, I might just stand up here. We have some work being done on a droid there. We have an operator there working and then we've got the officers meeting room we've got Grand Moff Tarkin in there then we've got these other cannons these do move up and down as well quite fun this it really is we do have a bridge just in there, if you can see, and we can operate it going up or down and up. Goes the full, goes that right down to the centre to the bottom of this. So that's really good. I'm really chuffed with that. Uh, we do have here a breakaway. We can actually take that out to uh, release Princess Leia from her cell block. And put that in there. Uh, some of the other things this does, this can uh, actually break and come down. Just make sure I put that back on. These things have got a tendency to come off, so they can be a bit of a pain sometimes. We've shown that moving. This all moves down here. We do have another lift just there which is operated that again can go down and it can come back up um, we do have a door here especially show you from this side and this again does open and then we can close it back up again do love some of the features on this that they made that work on it. Uh, I've shown the main gun. Uh, and this as well up here, we can actually change this from this. Just swap this round. Oh, without dropping it on the floor. Sorry, dizzy cam. 
and then we can bob that into there as well this does fire but if i'm just careful see what i mean flies across the room i'll put that back in in a second but this is i mean this is amazing that it all works it really is and i'm so chuffed with it i'm so glad i decided to rebuild this because sitting in a box not doing anything it doesn't really give it justice we do have some of the lower levels down there um there's not really much happening right down at the bottom but uh yeah this is the lego death star which is now complete i'm really really chuffed with it really chuffed and um yeah i'm so glad i decided to build it again um it's looking even better than when i first built it i um yeah i'm amazed by how this looks so guys if you like this video please could you give it a massive thumbs up if you haven't already subscribed please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell and be notified of any future videos thank you for coming along on this journey while i build this over the last uh, couple of months I did start it uh, in January, started cleaning all the bricks and everything, but it's been totally, totally worth it. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.